Hi dears, nice to meet you again. Now I am going to teach 10th uh, standard mathematics. The first chapter is relations and functions. First sum, let A set is 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 and B set is 2, 5, 8, 11, 14. B 2 sets. Let function, let us F. A tends to be, be a function given by f of x equal to 3x minus 1. The function is f of x equal to 3x minus 1. Represent this function by arrow diagram. So we have to come, uh, find out the arrow diagram. And second one, table form. Third one is order of pass. Fourth one is graph. So we have, we have to complete four types of questions. The first one by arrow diagram. So first we have to find the function a set you substitute the values in the function f of x. Then you get some values that is b set. Here uh, let, let us consider x. x values are 1, 2, 3, 4. Here a set is domain. b set is codomain. So here a set is 1, 2, 3, 4 are domain and 2, 5, 8, 11, 14 are codomain. So here we have to find range. How to find range? Here every a set values that is domain. Domain values to substitute that in the function f of x equal to 3x minus 1. Some get values. The values are range. Here a values are x values are 1. First x values 1. Solution. The first one, A set is 1, 2, 3, 4. The x values are 1, 2, 3, 4. Here the function is f of x. f of x equal to 3x minus 1. Here A set is x values. I assume first x value is 1. x value is 1. f of 1 is equal to 3 into x value. What is the x value? Yes, x value is first I consider 1. So here 1 then minus 1 implies. So 3 ones are 3. So 3 minus 1 implies. What is the value 3 minus 1? 2. This is first one. Then second x equal to 2. So x equal to 2 means here f of 2 is equal to 3 into 2 minus 1 implies 3 2s are 6 minus 1 implies 6 minus 1. What is the value? Puja. Tell me the answer. 6 minus 1? 5. So 5 is the answer. Then third one. x equal to 3. So next value is x value 3. Then f of 3, f of 3 is equal to 3 into x value, what is x value? 3, so now 3 minus 1, 3, 3 is a 9, so 9 minus 1, what is the 9 minus 1 value? 8, so 8, then x equal to 4, x equal to 4. So f of 4 is equal to 3 into 4 minus 1 implies what is the 3 4s are? 12. So 12 minus 1 implies 12 minus 1? 11. So we will get 11. That's it. So now uh, we have to find so x1 is 1 means you get f of 1 is equal to 2 that is codomain 2, 5, 8, 11 or codomain. So here b set is 2, 5, 8, 11, 14. But here x value 1 is what is the value you get? 2. 2 is the range. x value 2 is the domain. So 5 is the range. Then x value is 3 is y value uh, that is f of 3 is 8. That value is range. So 8 is a range. Then x equal to 4 means the 11 is a range. You have to find arrow diagram. First of all, arrow diagram. Arrow diagram. 
here a set what are the a set 1 2 3 4 so we have to write the elements elements are 1 2 3 4 what is the set yes a set so this one a set the next one is b set what is the b set elements 2 5 8 11 14 14 so 2 5 8 11 14 So now I will relate one x value one means what is the value get two. So one relate two, two relate five, three relate eight, four relate eleven. So now I will uh, draw the arrow diagram. So here arrow diagram. So one relate two. The first one one relate two. Next. x value to means what is the value 5 so 2 relay 5 the next x value 3 means what is the value 8 so 3 relay 8 next x value 4 means what is the value 11 so 4 relay 11 so here 1 2 3 4 are domain 2 5 8 11 14 are co domain what is the range Yes. What are the elements are relate in the set B? The elements only range. We have two, five, eight elements are range. So, arrow diagram is completed. The first is sums by by arrow diagram. So, arrow diagram is completed. The first one by by an arrow diagram. by an arrow diagram the first one so this is an arrow diagram the second one in a table form table form Table form. So here x is a domain, f of x is a range. Here x, this one f of x. What is the x value? Here domain value is one, two, three, four. So here one, two, three, four. Then. What is f of x? So here one relates two. That is f of x. So one par two. Then two relate five. So two par five. Then next three relates eight. So three par is eight. Then four relates eleven. So eleven. Now, this is table form. Third one is a set of order of pairs. Here one relate two. That is one comma two is a one order of pair. Then two comma five is a second order of pair. Three comma eight is a third order of pair. Four comma eleven is a fourth order of pair. That is for third. Set of Or a pair. The set of or a pairs. The function here. So what are all or a pairs here? One comma two is the first or a pair. So one comma two. Then second order of pair two comma five, third order of pair is three comma eight, fourth order of pair is four comma eleven. This is an order of pair. 
the fourth one a graph so how to draw the graph here what are the order of us that the points are plot in the graph graphical form that is a graph sheet is x axis and y axis the next fourth one a graph so how to draw the graph so here the horizontal line is called x axis vertical line is called y axis here x dash why i am writing x dash because here negative values the right hand side this positive values x a top y positive value b bottom y dash so this negative value zero this origin 0 comma 0 here 1 2 3 4 x values first two one one but that is me now but that is here x value is one so one next one two next value is three next value is four next value is five next value is six next value is seven Next value is a. Next value is nine. So x axis one centimeter one unit. Then y axis one centimeter one unit. So here eleven. So here eleven numbers. You have to draw the numbers. Here it is possible to draw the eleven. No. So here I will take y axis one centimeter two unit. So here two. The next day four. Next day six. Next day eight. Next day ten. Next day twelve. This x-axis one centimeter one unit. Y-axis one centimeter two unit. Why you taking two units? Because here uh, the length is uh, nearly short. So uh, that's why you are taking two units. Plot the points. Plot the points. So plot the points. What are the plot the points? One comma two is the first order of pairs. Second order of pairs is two comma five. The third order of pairs is three comma eight. Fourth order of pairs is four comma eleven. These points are plot in the graph sheet. So one comma two is the first order pair. Here one comma two. This one comma two. The second order pair is two comma five. So here two x value and here y value is five. So two comma five. Third order pair. Third order pair is. Three comma eight. So x value is three and y value is eight. X value is three. Y value is eight. So here x value is three, y value is eight, and then final four comma eleven. So x value is four. And y value is eleven. Four comma eleven. Now I will draw the line. So line here. Draw. Draw the line. Here one comma two, two comma five, three comma eight, four comma eleven. Joining the points one comma two to up to four comma eleven. So here, draw the line.
This is graph computer. So, following the videos, if you are watching the video, you will be able to study the study material, next question bank, and next self assessment. You will be able to do this. So, first, you will be able to complete the sums and full of complete the subject note. Next, you will be able to solve the question bank, creative questions, and the creative questions. That is the third one, you will be able to do self assessment. That is the third one. Sums வந்து நீங்கள் என்ன பண்ணுறீங்கனா first start பண்டுது முன்னிடு இங்கு parents இட்ட sign வாங்கிட்டு அதுகப் பரும் நீங்கள் இந்த question எடுதிட்டு start பண்ணுங்க start பண்ணிட்டு full complete பண்ணிட்டு ஒரு photo எடுத்து அது வந்து நீங்கள் school number whatsapp number இருக்கு அனுப்புங்க thank you students